second baby into the world is something unimaginable. The mother and the baby were taken to the hospital right away. They say that he was a few weeks early, but other than that, he is perfectly healthy. In Madera, AJ Cotto, KC24, local news that matters. AJ, thank you. Country stars taking the stage in the Tower District tonight so our Valley vets can take a flight. Some big country names and some up and coming Valley singers performing at the Tower Theater. 100% of the proceeds will help send Vietnam veterans to Washington, D.C. on the next honor flight. Our Megan Rube joining us live now. Megan, this flight for the first time is only for Vietnam veterans. Yes, organizers telling us they're slowly moving through their World War II and their Korean War veterans. So now it's time for those Vietnam vets to have their turn. And would you believe this, Alex, on some of the guys who played here tonight, they're veterans themselves. Backstage at Fresno's Tower Theater, Hanford's own J.J. Brown warming up. Hitting the stage to play and raise money for Valley veterans, hoping to soon take the flight of their life. Said I'm the guy for the job. Brown joined the Navy at 19, moving out to Lemoore. Working with uh, veterans organizations here in the Center Valley is really kind of cool because I've continued uh, my service by being a part of that family. Wednesday night, country fans getting up close and personal with country singers Dylan Scott, Matt Stell. I was excited uh, from the minute that we found out that we got the opportunity to come a couple months ago. Brown and Josh Grayson, also a Marine Corps veteran, meeting face-to-face -face with others who've served. When we shook hands, like, I got something for you, and he already knew what was in his hands. Tiffany Emanuel, serving in the Moor, spent 19 years with the U.S. Navy. As a token of thanks, she handed Grayson this, a challenge coin from her squadron. We exchange them with other people when people do a really good job. But tonight, another exchange, some sweet music to send veterans to D.C. We don't ever want to have a flight come up short. We don't want to leave anybody home. We've got almost 400 veterans on a waiting list. Brown hoping to send a message from the heart. To remind people that it's okay to stand up and feel proud as a veteran. And honor flight organizers tell us those World War II and Korean War veterans still have priority if they need to get onto a flight. So just call the honor flight if you know one. Also, next flight coming up is in May. After that, in the fall. Reporting live tonight in Fresno's Tower District, Megan Roop, KC24, local news that matters. Megan, thank you. Developing tonight, a police chase near Fresno City College ends in a multi-car collision. The pursuit.